In the Spring 18 release, we've added opportunity splits to the Salesforce Lightning user interface to enhance and better track team selling. Here's a quick overview demonstration to see how it works. In this scenario, Jeremy is a sales rep looking at an opportunity in Salesforce. Here he has an opportunity to sell furniture to ABC Bank. You can see that three products have been added to this opportunity, sofas, desks, and tables. Jeremy also has an opportunity team that he's working with. Here you can see some of those team members. Let's say Jeremy needs to include other team members on this opportunity and create an opportunity split. In order to do that, we can click to open the opportunity split window. When we do that, we can see the different types of splits that we can create. Out of the box, there are two standard opportunity split types, revenue and overlay. You also have the ability to configure custom split types, for example, a profit margin split type. And also, the split type page is configurable. So if you wanted to capture more information, you could create additional columns and fields and do that. Now let's look at this first type of split, revenue splits. This is typically used for commission payouts, where the total commission would equal 100%. You can see that Jeremy's team members, Eli and Bill, have been added to the split. And at the bottom right, you can see that the allocation percent is 100%. If it doesn't equal 100%, the user is going to get an error message. I'll go ahead and show you what that looks like. So here you can see the error indication. And I'll just go ahead and discard those changes. We can also see that the total revenue amount, in this case it's just over 1.1 million, is getting divided among the team members. And if I wanted to, I could add additional team members just by clicking and adding more rows and I can delete them as well. Let's take a look at the second opportunity split type. In this case of an overlay scenario, I can click on the overlay tab and here I can define any person I want to credit the overlay rep and the primary rep. In this case, it doesn't need to equal 100. And again, you have the ability to define custom split types. And what's great is that all the split information rolls up to Jeremy's management team and can be viewed and tracked in the forecast. So let's just close this here and take a look at the forecast. Now here on the forecasting tab, I can see Jeremy's teammate, Bill, who's also working on that furniture deal. And if I select Bill down below, I can see Bill's opportunities and I see ABC Bank and the forecasted amount that's the revenue credit from the split. And here I can see the split amount of 25%, which is Bill's allocation. So as you can see, opportunity splits in Salesforce Lightning provide a great way to track and manage opportunity splits where there are opportunity teams.